Welcome. <laughs> Vlog one. My name is Madison. I'm just a girl on the internet, and you are watching Turbo Glam. <laughs> I have done vlogs before, and I know that you guys like my old vlogs. We're restarting them. Ain't that right, Chief? Look at him. He's ready for a vlog. Without further ado, this is Turbo Vlog One. I was just beating the crap out of my S13 and unsuccessfully still cannot get the control arm loose from the knuckle. And it's so annoying. So annoyed with myself. So we're we're gonna we're we're vlogging again. The Audi is very dirty. Yeah. I'm currently in this uh mechanic fit. I'm gonna change right now. Yeah. I came out with hoodies. I did announce these on every other social except for YouTube. I'm sorry. If you would like a hoodie, I'm wearing a 3X right now. I love them. I only have two X's and three X's left. Only a few. I feel really bad about not telling you guys on YouTube about it. So if you guys want one, for you guys only, use this code. I don't even know what code we're gonna use, but uh, use this code. <laughs> You'll save half off on the hoodies. Let's go watch the Audi. Let's get some food so inspired by Kai she's always vlogging I honestly miss it so much I miss it so much like please go check out Kai her cute ass Miata I love her and I'm gonna see her in a month I gotta put on shoes we're existing Audi I didn't even lock it before so good I know that my life is like very different from what it used to be, especially from when I was vlogging before. I'm not gonna delete my old vlog part of my life. Like there's footage of me from working at Nissan on there and, and it's true to everything that I was living at that time. So I will not be deleting it. <laughs> and that does include my ex-boyfriend, Zach. I personally feel the need to address that. He was in a ton of my older videos. I feel awkward now. I feel very awkward talking about this now. Yeah, my voice is starting to shake. <sighs> I'll say this and I hope that it maybe helps some of you guys. I think that it's okay to love someone. It's also okay to recognize that you have grown apart from someone or recognizing a relationship is hurtful to the people that you can be. I, uh, relationships are hard <laughs> as fuck. Um, I personally am just like not dating anymore. So if you're gonna ask that question, that is the answer. But I felt like I needed to address that. It's totally okay to recognize recognize that you have grown into a great person with someone and also to recognize that we can grow beyond that. I don't know what else to say. Let's go. I want to go wash my car. I feel very awkward now talking about my ex. <sighs> Zach is a great guy. That's all I'll say. My heart is like <laughs> not talked about this in a long time. So let's go wash my car. Oh my god. It smells hella good in here right now. <laughs> Oh, well, definitely quality, so. Yes. Um, that's actually really cute. Uh, will they let me do that? Uh, continue? Okay. I love them. Thank you, auto wash. That's such a cute thing to do. I'm so glad I'm filming. Like, how adorable. 41, 530. I'm gonna cry. That's fucking so cute. Um, I should probably put away my camera. So, we're gonna do a before shot and after. I got this little from Ikea. <laughs> it actually works fucking well. Yo. It's cold. It just was like washing my car and thinking about how cute it is. <sighs> That they're donating to autism awareness. Like, this doesn't really matter. You know what I mean? Like, who cares? I don't care what mental illness you have. It feels appropriate to say that I did find out that I'm autistic. <laughs> Didn't take like a formal diagnosis with a doctor or anything, but I did take the RADS-R test. I'm gonna link it below. <laughs> 
I'm I'm like honestly speechless and I think that it's a great segue to kind of talk about this and I think that so many of us are so like afraid to talk about mental illness. I don't even, I don't like to say that either. Are afraid to kind of go further just being sad and I think that there's nothing wrong with that. I was really happy to find out that I'm autistic. I was like, really? <laughs> Everything makes sense now. <laughs> Awareness is great. Thank you, Auto Wash. They're a great company. Not only do they have great washes, soaps and everything. I used Auto Wash before I was an ambassador. 100% I'm an ambassador, so my washes are free. I will always be transparent with you guys. Before I was that, I used these washes because they're so good on your car. I'm really happy to see that. Even if I wasn't an ambassador, I would be donating to Autism Awareness as well because cars are most definitely definitely my special interest and it makes me me it makes me turbo glam if you've seen me use scissors i think that you would probably already know but cars are really cool i'm quite literally obsessed with them and i never understood why until i found out about autism so uh tism awareness <laughs> in my vlog as well shout out to auto wash thank you for bringing it up i love uh i love talking about stuff that matters um wow hero complex okay i uh don't really know what to want to eat. That's kind of crazy, isn't it? Considering. Let's uh, let's drive and figure it out. Oh, I kind of want Taco Bell. Yeah, I do want Taco Bell. So I'm gonna get it and it's gonna suddenly appear in my hands right now. Yay, you're awesome. Thanks, you too. I'm afraid to put this down. I don't know. Yeah. You guys. Taco Bell chips are so good. I'm gonna eat this and then we're gonna do my hair. I know you're so excited. Good morning. I ended up just going to bed. Like, I think, yeah, you can see the Taco Bell. It's still there. Let me throw it out. I'm looking at these flowers. Chief, are you still alive? At least these look good. So, Chief, how we doing? Peace. What the fuck, man? Girl. Anyway, can I do this all cute? Maybe. Oh. Oh my gosh, she's a chef. She's a chef. I'm gonna dye my hair. This blonde like ends or whatever. And I really like a money piece where it's like that blonde strip in the front. I'm just gonna give myself a little bit more of one because it's kind of dark here with these like very small baby hairs. It's good, bleach the baby hairs. Does this look good? For the babes wondering, this is what I'm using. I pretty much just did like one to one there. Do you like my uh, reading material? I'm gonna change really quick. <laughs> so the first thing that I do, I'm gonna turn this light on. I'm gonna brush out my hair. Bruh. Wow. And uh, I kind of like having my hair a little bit like greasy before I do this um, so that the bleach doesn't fuck it up too much. Nice, nice. Absolutely should be wearing gloves. I usually let this sit for like 20, 30 minutes. Um, be right back. Hi. <clears throat> Um, so I blow dried it. I think it looks pretty good. I think I definitely need to go see M soon, but not bad. There are a couple areas like right here. I didn't really get like close enough to my hairline, so I still have my natural color there, but it's okay. We won't talk about it. Not bad for a car girly. That's a joke because Emily is a car girl and like, if anything, she's way more of a car girl than I am. I have a little... 
I guess they're big. Chiefs is high. I forget what they're called, but I'm breaking out so bad. I'll put them here. They're really nice. I have an order for Turbo Glam. I figured I'd pack it. I'm not sure if Sam watches my videos, but quick little shout out to Sam because she placed an order with me and I love her photography work. She's amazing. Go check her out. We're gonna pack my order for her. I am wearing a... I have mechanics feet syndrome. I don't know what that means, but I know a lot of people don't know that. I have thank you cards for all my orders. Um, this is one of them. I think that I'm gonna send her. This one's also appropriate for her because she's a photographer. Yeah, let's do this one. So this and then the last two. And I actually am so excited for my new order to come in so that I don't have to hand cut these out anymore <laughs> because hand cutting them out is like, Oh, Mads, who made that decision? Me, I did, it was me. I, I made this stupid decision. I literally was like, oh, it's not a big of a deal. Insert photos here. No, it was a big deal. Sam, I'm really sorry that this one is bent. Like I said, they're my last two. Oh, <laughs> it literally takes me so long. So I go three and a half inches down and then two and a half inches high. Last year, all my friends were just like, why are you doing this? I was like, I don't know. <laughs> then I go at an inch and a quarter for like where I cut it. I'm sure this is really interesting footage, you guys. Wow. My factory makes them so much cuter now. That's why, because then it goes on this. And I even have to trim it from here because girl boss, where the fuck are the stickers? Because there was a point where I was literally cutting out stickers. Okay, so these are like this. Sometimes I would have to go to the print store and print out like labels I would like beg the people at the print store like please just let me like print out this like I'm stupid That's what the moral of the story is. Don't be like me. Don't be stupid. Barbie is smarter Don't get it twisted because it like sticks out at the end. I cut the ends off I'm OCD. I can't I can't so then I staple it with my mini stapler it's cuter. Come on. Like, look at that little baby staple. I think that this has already taken me five minutes. No, that's, I'm probably exaggerating. And then I put the scent sticker over the top. Very DIY homemade, but that's V1, okay? Second one that I'll ever do of this watermelon. Thank God. Just kidding. Honestly, I was so stubborn being like, oh no, like this is gonna be the better way. Like these are really cute and I love this design, but I really do want these to be accessible to a lot more people. And if I was like doing this, I wouldn't be able to do other cool stuff. Whoa! <laughs> um, this one I did not really cut perfectly because, you know. Ah! Mother trucker, dude. Mother that hurt like trucker, a dude. Stick. That hurt like a butt yeah. cheek on a stick. Science. I love that I have acne patches on right now. It's the aesthetic. I think it's important to add that this is right next to me. Don't try me. Thank you. It got a little hot in there, so it got a little sweaty. I bet it smells good as fuck in there though. Sorry. And every time I staple it, I make sure to get like on this like plastic art art so that it doesn't release the scent. Release the Kraken. Mini staple. Oh, just darling. Will it be straight? Be straight. I actually can't see at all. I'm just trusting. Hey, that's not bad. On the card, it adds like rigidity so that these don't get bent in the mail. That like actually terrifies me. Terrifies me. You guys can't see what I'm writing her. Sorry. So I'm going to zoom in. I bought these uh, kids markers and they smell so good. Aw. Sam, I'm sending you my last gooseberry. It's just for you, babe. Thank you for your support, Sam. I appreciate you. I hope this gets to you safely. Eddie, shout out to Eddie again for letting me take so long to pull my knuckles off for him. Like, I am ridiculous. He sent me a tool, like a ball joint separator tool. It's like one that has a fork that you essentially tighten a screw on one end. I think I'm gonna go see if I can pick one up at my local parts store. She's a peachy gal. I don't know. I don't really have a point to this vlog. I, I, I don't really do anything of importance, honestly. Um, I really appreciate your guys' support as always. And so uh, I'm just a girl on the internet, but at least I can edit, kind of, right?
it. Should I end it here? Yeah, I am gonna end it here. <laughs> Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Cheers. I just wanna have fun, clap my hands, turn around now and dance, dance, dance. I just wanna have fun, clap my hands, turn around now and dance, dance, dance. I, I, I just wanna have fun, clap my hands, turn around now and dance, dance, dance. I just wanna have fun, clap my hands, turn around now and dance, dance, dance. I just wanna, I just wanna clap, clap, turn around, turn around, dance, dance, dance. I just wanna, I just wanna clap, clap.